Hey everybody, it's Allison Jones here with Osborne Books and More, and I just wanted to go over with you a few of our mid-season releases for 2018. I'm excited about many of these books, and I have a few that I want to show you really quickly. The first one is our Poppet. Now, Poppet is this little guy right here. It comes in this box, um, and what's cool about a Poppet is it can be a book. It can be kind of um, you know a little lovey for your child, um, and a puppet all in one, so that can do it like this and you can use it like a puppet and so what it's also it's very smooth and silky it has a nice um, feel to it and it'll tell a story about pretty kitty loves to dance and it has um, great word choices she'll skip and leap and twirl and prance make kitty dance and so you use your little poppet to make her dance and make kitty drink and then finally to give kitty a hug and so it's actually telling a story um, but a nice little gift idea there Another book that's new for the season, mid-season, is um, What's It Like in Space? And this comes from our Lift the Flap First Questions and Answers series. Um, and you can see it's a nice size. It's not too big. So for those inquiring minds, uh, what's it like in space? How do you get there? Where can you go in space? And within each of these broad categories, there are other questions, and you lift the flap to find the answer. What do astronauts do all day? Um, so that one is a neat one with a topic that kids often want to hear about. Our Wipe Clean, many of you are familiar with our Wipe Clean books, but this one is a new title, Under the Sea. And so what I like about the activity style Wipe Clean is that, you know, oftentimes we'll use the ABC ones or the, the counting ones, um, but the kids, you know, feel like they're having to learn. With these, they're learning without realizing it. So you have a maze, but then find and circle four shells. So they're practicing counting skills. Um, you have, you know, dot to dot type things, but then you also have jellyfish that match and you're drawing a line between them. So great colorful illustrations on these. They're tracing the numbers here and just lots of fun for the kids in your life, especially those who are maybe obsessed with things under the sea like sharks and whales and things like that. So, and then we also have a new line, our new baby book in our line of Baby's First Playbooks, and this one is about the body. So, a neat one with several different cutouts and the finger trails. I especially like this little page where you trace the body, and then it has things labeled arm, head, tummy, and you can see again, bright illustrations, lots of fun. There's lots of great verbs in here of things your body um, you use it to do, like sniff or, um, let's see, see, taste, smell, build, run, dance. So, a fun book for the little ones in your life. And then one that's a neat one that I couldn't wait to get my hands on, Never Get Bored Book. So I thought about, you know, summer break with this one. And inside this one, um, it's asking, are you bored? And then it goes into just lots of things. Instead of getting bored, here's all the things you can do. It's 120 something of those. And then things you can do if you pick up a pencil, some drawing activities, um, how to test your senses. I mean, it just goes on and on. So you can imagine how much fun kids would have um, pulling out a new activity from the Never Get Bored book or you just handing it over when you hear those words, um, especially in, I think, about the summertime. So, and, mo and a lot of these are educational too, so it's not just that they're doing something, you know, like playing a video game. So, thanks for watching.